Hey guys, it's your girl Brianna, and I know I haven't posted in a while. You know, so much As you know, the coronavirus is out, so if you're bored, I have some life hacks for you. First, it's going to be out for arts and crafts. I made paper iPhones that, you know, you can play with. In today's video, I'm going to show a tutorial of how to make a paper iPhone. So, what you need is paper, markers, and glue. So, once you got all of those items, here's what you do. You get the piece of paper, then you fold it like this. So after you do that, you want to also fold the piece of paper like this. So what I fold it like is this, or like that. After you do that, you want you see these edges here? Don't fold them up all the way, but I want you to fold them up like this. Now, now right here is where the glue starts. So what you want to do with the glue is this side, you want to glue right here. Uh, glue right here. Glue all right there. Do you want to fold it? So when you do this side with all that little paper, some will flap up, but you just have to keep gluing it, gluing it like this. Because there's a lot of paper. You're gonna do it again. By the way, guys, I prefer you to use a glue stick because if you use one of those glues where you screw it out, it won't work really good. So I'd rather you use a glue stick. So after you glue this side, glue the other side. Like that. So after you did both sides, you want to go to the back. This is where you start making, like, whatever iPhone you want. iPhone 7, iPhone 8, iPhone 6, iPhone 11, iPhone XR, do whatever. But before we get to the back, make sure you glue these. Because you don't want them, like, out while you're trying to, like, play with it. So what you do is you grab your glue stick. You want to glue it like this. Like that. Then you glue the other side the same way. For me, I prefer you to use the, not this purple glue, but if you want to, you can. But I prefer you to use the white glue because it's not very seeable. Okay, so after that, you want to push it down. The reason I'm saying you want to prefer white glue instead of this purple glue is because it could get all over, like right here, and it can make a few mistakes, but it's going to dry. But you can use it if you want. Now, this part is where, sorry, is where we get to the back. This is where we get right here. So. This is glued all the way. So what you want to do is you want to pick one of these markers or pens or whatever you want. But for me, I want to do a special apple symbol. So I'm going to show you how I do it. Okay, guys, so here's my apple symbol. Please do not make fun because 